Well, healthcare professionals remaining on the front lines of the war, treating those who have been injured. Some hospital administrators from Ukraine are in the capital region this week learning about our health care system. News 10 ABC Skylar Eagle explaining what they hope to take with them when they return to Ukraine. Ukrainian healthcare workers are getting a first-hand look at Capital Region hospitals through a partnership with the International Center of the Capital Region. The week-long visit starts here at Hudson Valley Community College, where they'll meet with faculty about emergency medicine. To get a general sense of, you know, uh, techniques that are that are used, um, what they can learn and bring back to Ukraine, especially with the. Uh, you know, the way that the environment is right now. Then they'll move to Russell Sage College, New York State Department of Health, Ellis Hospital, Albany Medical Center, and SUNY Polytechnic Institute to learn more about different programs, resources, and equipment in each facility. As the war in Ukraine continues, local doctors hope it will provide much needed help and resources with some connections closer to home than others. I still have extended family in Ukraine. I talk to him basically on a weekly basis. And I call to my fellow physician who I used to work and I try to do whatever possible to supply and to train that in this extremely hard time. Along the road, they'll also learn about the new advanced stitches currently being developed by SUNY Polytechnic Institute that could change how we look at medical care, especially in emergency situations. They're looking at ways to make sure that it would make sense economically to produce it and to figure that out. And that's a process that can take, you know, a few years perhaps. But uh, for something that is so necessary, um, there are, might be ways to, to fast track that. Reporting in Troy, Skyther Eagle, News 10, ABC.